Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be trying the Swift Walker coffee. Alright, the lamp lighter coffee's got a hint of peach candy, nougat, and floral. This is a light roast. This is set to a coarse grind. And we're gonna put six tablespoons into the brew track French press. A nice consistency. I normally just try and get them as flat as I can. All right, we're gonna boil some water using our Kasori uh, induction pot. And once it heats up, uh, we're going to pour it in. We're going to let the um, coffee grounds kind of heat up and then settle. And then we'll top it off and then we'll sit for uh, four minutes. You can watch the coffee grounds rise and then they will form a crust and then it should fall here in just a second. And there it goes. Once it drops, just Top it off. And then the four minutes begins. I always give it a good stir just to make sure that everything is even. I'll put the top on it and We'll see you in about four minutes. All right, our four minutes is up. What I normally do is I just pull the top off. I break the crust. You all can see it's a little bit of a crust. And that just helps when you push the press down so that you're not pushing a block of uh, coffee grounds, or at least the ones that haven't fallen to the bottom yet. 
And the Brutec has got a uh, screen. And it's got a plate on the top, which kind of helps in all of that. Sometimes as it gets to the bottom, it gets a little rough, tight. And I found that if you just pull up on the press a little bit, it'll push right down. That's it. All right, so the, again, that this is the uh, Lamplighter Coffee Roasters um, Swift Walker Blend. It's a light roast uh, with a hint of pecan, candy, nougat, and um, some floral. So let's give it a taste. It's nice and smooth. It's uh, not very bitter. Um, it's got a doesn't have an aftertaste, so I think this will be a good cup of coffee for us. Thank you guys so much for watching and also making a cup of coffee with Ava and Dan. Have a good night.